Hi guys and welcome to Garden Warfare 2 Mythbusters, the series where we check out a whole bunch of GW2 myths suggested by you guys. In these videos I test your plants vs zombies theories to discover whether they are fact or fiction. If you have any other myths you would like busting, leave a suggestion in the comments below and it may be featured in the next video. The first myth we have comes from Fury Diamond who said, Myth, you can melt the Yeti in the ice map faster by shooting at it with flaming projectiles. After spending several minutes going through the entire turf takeover map, I finally made it to the Yeti King. I decided the best way to test this was to not activate any of the mirrors, so this would test whether the fire projectiles defrosted the Yeti or not. Starting off with Cricket Star, I began firing at the big block of ice, but unfortunately it didn't do anything. Not wanting to be defeated, I decided to bring out the big guns, so I switched to Lil Drake. Again, nothing from the primary weapon, so I called in the Meckenhausen to heat things up a bit further, but sadly, nothing happened. I did test to see whether once one mirror had been activated, whether shooting the ice with fire made it melt faster. I allowed the ice to start thawing without fire in the one clip, and then did it again while shooting the ice with fire projectiles in the other clip. Interestingly, when timing it, it actually took long longer to defrost whilst I was shooting the ice with fire. So unfortunately this myth is busted. Myth number two comes from Shadow King. You are able to shoot Citron's primary weapon during the Citron Ball animation. Let's put it to the test. Now, the result of this myth was actually a lot more interesting than I was expecting, so the initial test involved two trials. The first attempt was to use the Citron Ball ability whilst holding down the fire button to see if the beam continued during the transformation. Unfortunately, this did not work. The second trial was to use the ability and then try to press the fire button, but again, no dice. Now, I could have held the test there and completely busted the myth, but I discovered that if you hold down the Citron Ball ability button and the fire button at the same time, this animation starts to happen. Citron gets stuck in an endless loop of transforming between ball mode and assault mode, and this results in a repeated short burst of the orange beam. This basically turns Citron into a turret as you always have to reload between bursts. Therefore, this myth was true. Sticking with Citron, the next myth is a nice simple one and was suggested by P Shooter PVZ. Foot Soldier can kill Citron in a single clip. Using my laptop and my other Origin account, I set the battlefield up to test this theory. This is a straightforward test, put a little defenseless Citron in front of a foot soldier and see what happens. And there you go, so this myth is indeed true, foot soldier can vanquish Citron in a single clip. Myth number 4 is from Cursed Statue who said, Bling heal station can heal faster than metal heal station. After allowing scientists to be hit repeatedly by a P cannon, the lowest health I could get to was 2 without dying, so the test was ran between the time it took both healing stations to heal scientists from 2 HP back up to 100. Putting the clips side by side, this is what happened. Yep, so actually this myth ended up being flipped on its head. The metal healing station took 13 seconds and 6 milliseconds to heal, whereas the bling healing station was actually slower, finishing on 13 seconds and 42 milliseconds, so a 36 millisecond difference. So myth number 4 is busted. The final myth is from Edom, Super Commando's third shot can be cancelled by using an ability. Again, a nice simple one we can test anywhere, and as you can see, yes, Super Commando's third shot can be cancelled by using an ability. This works with all three of his abilities, and it's not too tricky to get the timing right. Furthermore, you can actually interrupt Super Commando's first shot, so you have two bullets left in the clip once the ability has been activated. This myth was true. So, there you are guys, five Garden Warfare 2 myths success really busted. I hope you enjoyed the first episode of hopefully a long series of myth busting. Thank you once again to everyone for their suggestions. If you have any other myth ideas, let me know in the comments below and it might get featured next time. But other than that, don't forget to hit those like and subscribe buttons, turn on notifications and if you want to support the channel further, check out my Patreon page by clicking on screen now or through the link in the description. Okay, thanks guys. Bye. Bye.